Hey guys, Madeline Harvey here, and thank you so much for joining me today. In today's video, we're gonna talk about how you can sing with total confidence now. So if you like today's video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up or click the subscribe button below. I would love to see you here more often. And if you have a specific question that you would like for me to answer, well, feel free to leave it in the comments portion of today's video. So let's go ahead and get started. Confidence. When I'm, when I'm beginning voice lessons with every student that I have, I love to ask them, what's a major goal for you as a singer? And nine out of 10 singers will say, I just want to express myself with total confidence. So then I ask them, well, what does that mean? What's total confidence to you? And I encourage you to do the exact same. Pause this video if you need to, and just take a second and explore what is confidence to you? Because it may be something totally different to you than it is to me. So go ahead and pause this video and take a second and work it out. Or not. But either way, I'll go ahead and share with you what my definition of confidence is. My definition of confidence is the ability to freely, important word, express myself fully, another important word, without any expectations. That's hard. What? Now, okay, let me, let me go further to say that it's absolutely fine to have standards to have specific goals for your voice and reach them. And it's even better to have great taste, you know, for yourself or a vision for yourself that you would like to be. However, expectations are a different thing entirely. Expectations set you up for disappointment and disappointment or fear is the annihilator of confidence. So again, when I, start with a, when I start with a singer, we'll talk about confidence a little bit, and I come to learn that that's what has crushed their confidence earlier in life, is that people have failed to react in a positive way to their voice when they were courageous enough to put themselves out there, right? It, may, it maybe didn't work. Well, again, the reason for that is the expectation. So if you have no expectations, you won't be disappointed. So again, just it's, it's kind of like a reframing of your mind. It's like a reprogramming of a definition. Don't focus on things that you cannot control. Focus instead on how you would like your experience of your singing or the song to be for you, okay? So that's what we're gonna talk about in today's video. And I wanna go further with this to say that the voice is absolutely controlled by the nervous system. So this is why you may sound absolutely amazing in the shower or the car, but when you introduce the whole audience as a factor, suddenly expectations and fear are introduced uh, and it creates anxiety in the body. Lots of electricity is moving through the body, causing the muscles to, don't look at me, like protect yourself. In essence, you're trying to protect yourself. So we're gonna address the idea of feeling free within yourself, which leads to confidence from a different angle. We're gonna address it from an energetic angle, which I feel doesn't really get a lot of attention or nurturing in a lot of people. So you might be like, what? Energy, uh? So we're going to work with a powerful application of imagination. It's just as powerful, again, because the voice is controlled by the nervous system. So what I would like for you to do, if you can, is go ahead and stand up Okay, and open your arms nice and wide and just feel how you feel. If your first response is to go, oh, I don't like this, then okay, you've got some really tight energy around you because you don't want to be seen, okay? So we're going to get the body comfortable with just feeling open. Be as big, widen your stance if you have to. Be as big with your body as you can. Okay, if your body can be big and be comfortable with it, right, be willing to be seen, then your voice will do the same thing. It's all intertwined, it's the same machine. So from here, I want you to imagine, application of imagination, imagine 
in your mind that you can extend your arm, your go-go gadget arm, all the way to the wall and touch the wall with your energy. So lots of active energy through your arm. You might even see like one arm is like and the other arm is just kind of laying there. Well, extend energy through the other arm too. Make it as big as possible, okay? Check in with your stomach. Is your stomach muscles tightened? And if they are, go ahead and relax them. Just tell yourself, I'm comfortable. I'm relaxed. I'm okay to be seen. I can make myself really, really big and be seen. And that's fine. Okay, now, imagination again. Imagine that there's a tiny little bubble in your belly, right under your rib cage, in the center of your being. This might be where you experience a lot of that anxiety or those butterflies. But imagine that this bubble starts very small and that it grows really, really, really big. And it fills the entire room with you. Fill the room with you, okay? And I want you to say to yourself, I am here. Yeah, yeah, I am here. I am ready. I am willing to be seen because we haven't really sung yet. I'm willing to be seen. Okay, if your arms get tired, shake them off and then come back to it. Lots of energy, fill the room with you until your body feels so comfortable. It feels really, really good. It feels so nice to be big and that you can extend your energy all the way up to the ceiling, all four corners of the room. Now say to yourself, voice, I would like for you to feel the same way. So extend your voice like, ah, in the same way, not going for perfect sound, but again, shake your arms off if you need to. What we're going for is exploring the space out in front of you with your voice, without pushing it. Just let it kind of fill the room. Keep your belly, keep that bubble here nice and open. Ah! And keep doing it until you're, you can feel your voice. It was the same thing as the bubble. It filled the room, okay? You're filling the room with you and you're trusting that that is okay. You're kind of becoming comfortable with a new scenario, which is being open. Okay. and rest. <laughs> Woo, there's a workout for the arms, but this is very crucial, again, because when you step into a public place and you can kind of feel that people are looking at you, it's very normal to go with the energy, right, to protect yourself. And this is probably why, you know, you might have experience of performing on stage, but there's always that feeling of being blocked somehow, and that's energetic. You're pulling your energy in totally subconsciously because you believe you're in danger or it's not safe. So again, spend time, just, oh man, a minute, every day. You'll even notice your posture change. Stand a little taller. You'll breathe a little deeper. When you go into public places, you'll find that people are just looking at you like, what? Wow, and it's not about being perfect. Get rid of that idea entirely. It's just about being open, filling a space with who you are. Mm, it's delicious. People are drawn to it. There's something about a person, right? That's the whole thing with energy that we don't quite mentally understand, but we do with our hearts and our intuitions. We feel drawn to certain people because there's just a quality about them, a light sometimes we say, you know, and it's our job as artists to fill the world with light. Not to get all hippie on you all of a sudden, but yes, it's a very powerful thing to be free within ourselves. So we start to do that by making our body big, feeling comfortable with it, extending our energy to fill a room, and then practicing it with our voice. What I feel when I practice this is the sense of opening, like right on the inside. It feels like my voice opens, like on the inside, or that my whole body's like a cabinet that just loud, like opens, and I'm suddenly, I'm Care Bear staring everybody that I come in contact with. And you practice this enough, and you won't have to practice it. You'll just be open and confident 
and you'll be able to freely express yourself without any expectations because man it feels so good to be that open and to express who cares what anybody else thinks right because it feels so delicious and yummy to be so open okay i hope you've enjoyed today's video please feel free to uh, send me your questions in the comments portion of today's video or give today's video a thumbs up but please practice this Feel how amazing that feels to make your body big, your voice big, your energy big, okay? I can't wait to hear your success stories or send me a little video link of you singing, okay? I would love to hear from you guys. Thank you so much for joining me today and I will see you next time.